Perry, what a drama. What did you think when you got the phone call? I was just so disappointed for Reese and Phoebe and, you know, Eric and um, Lauren because they've worked so hard. And, and Reese in particular, I think, uh, is a natural dancer and he'd really found his feet. Yes. And um, I, to be honest, my young dance partner's a bit disappointed because I, I didn't expect one. Yeah, I'm not delusional. <laughs> I'm 17 years older than the next oldest contestant. Yes. Um, and I, I was just there for the fun, really. So, um, so when they rang, were you, what was your reaction? What was your gut telling you? And my gut was saying, oh, no. <laughs> no. And I was trying to get hold of... I mean, I was at work, so I was, it was in the 11 a.m. news break that John rang me and said, under the rules, you know... You, you're coming, You're coming back. back. And then I tried to get hold of Jared, and he was working. And so he found out at about one o'clock yesterday that we were back in. So he had to choreograph, you know, one new dance and then another one because we have a trio. I was going to say, because you, are, you also have a very truncated timeline this week. You have to learn two dances in 36 hours? Yeah. I we mean, go that... into rehearsals tomorrow tomorrow what? morning at 8 in the morning. <laughs> it's, like, it's the weirdest experience, Rebecca, I have to tell you. They'll come asking. You've got the perfect little well, dancer's body. Tell so. them that I can't dance. <laughs> right? You let them know ahead of time. Um, and so, and you are back into the semi-final as well. So it is the competition that is back on. You are right back in there, Kerry. Do you know what, though? I don't see it as a competition now. With, with one of the best dancers out, mm. um, yeah. you know, I see it more as an entertaining bit of gorgeous light relief for people after such a dismal couple of years of news and, you know, yes. relentless kind of grimness. Yes. Um, it's just froth and light and fun and, and we're raising money for really, really good charities. So yeah. all of our charities matter. Reese's matter. I mean, and we're such a tight crew as well. Yes. I got a lovely message from Reese today saying if you want a shoulder to cry on or any support and, you know, yes. how decent is that? I was wondering actually what the feeling is um, on the show and among the contestants at the moment because it is not what anybody wanted, is no. it? To have the competition. You guys have worked really, really hard uh, to get to all all the different places that you've you know ended up in and yeah this is, seems very unfair it does I felt I really felt for them I mean it's great you know that Brody's still there Jazz is still there yeah. you know that the rest of them are but honestly when we were eliminated I took off up to the Hokianga and Jared and his partner came up too and I hadn't had a drink for two months and so we drank <laughs> and we ate and then it was like nah oh no <laughs> being sucked back into it. <laughs> Kerry, I wondered, is it a little freeing? It sounds like it's freeing for you to go back this time because it looks it's scary. It looks terrifying. I know you had some stage fright. That looked uh, awful, horrific. It but, was. But <laughs> does this feel different? It does. It really does. It just feels like, you know... Like every workplace, you just have to step up when somebody gets COVID and make sure the show goes on or the you know the the, the job goes on. Mm. And so that's what I feel we're doing. That um, I'd like to dance better. I'd like to do well. Um, but we're really there to keep the show on the road and to, and to keep raising money for Reese's charity, Eric's, mine, you know, yes. all of our charities. And you will be hoping, uh, you know, that the the COVID cases stop here. Well, yes, although... Could I've, end up in a weird place. Uh, I know. I've had it, so I feel that's my superpower. OK, OK. Um, and so I think if they all succumb, what would happen? No. You would be the queen. I would be the queen. You would I'd be the clutching dancing. the glitter ball trophy. <laughs> but no. I, that would that, be great TV. And that kind of creepy kind of way, yes. I would... It would be for all of us. There would not be yeah. one winner because COVID would have won and I can't have that. Ah, well, we are, I'm so excited to see you back out there on the dance floor and 48 hours from now, great good luck. Yeah, I'm going to need a little bit of it. <laughs> <laughs> Jared's done so well. We've got a great um, trio partner in uh, Johnny Williams. He's So that's very exciting because I'm a, such a fangirl of the show. So Amazing. to be able to dance with Johnny is just so exciting. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. I can't wait to see it. Thanks so much for joining us. Thank Carrie. you. Thank you.